What's going on social media? Aaron, Fish Addictions TV, and I'm bummed. This is the very last episode of Season 3, Fish Addictions TV. Uh, it's the finale. It, we're going to kind of go out with a bang. We're doing a Hunter's Helping Heroes episode, which is uh, military vets. We're taking them out fishing and letting them just relax and enjoy time out on the water. Um, we're we're going to be cooking up some fish. We're going to be having fun. We're going to be relaxing. We're going to be fishing. And there's a lot of companies and a lot of sponsors that have put in to make this event awesome. This We've been doing this for a couple of years. This is our third uh, time filming this event. The last two times, the last two years actually, um, those are on YouTube if you want to go check them out. Just go to YouTube and type in Fish Addictions TV, Hunters Helping Heroes, and for season one and season two, and you'll be able to basically get an idea of what, what this event is leading up into this week's episode, which is season three, Hunters Helping Heroes. We go to Devil's Lake, North Dakota. Uh, we have eight vets. A few of them we fly in, some of them um, are local. Usually we go to Baudette, but this year we're going to Devil's Lake. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be a blast. I can't wait for you guys to hear some of the vet stories and just see a bunch of good people um, having a good time out on the water. Season three coming to an end, season finale. We want to thank everyone. Like I said, we're already planning for next season, season four. Um, even though that it is coming to an end here, our social media is still going to be active. Uh, our Instagram, our YouTube, our Facebook, uh, Snapchat, etc. Go give us a like, a follow, a subscribe. Um, those places are where we're going to continue to put out more giveaways. We're going to continue to put out uh, information that some people might not find anywhere else. And to be able to stay up to date with us uh, is going to be awesome. This season, going into open water, we're going to be doing open water stuff, fishing, tri uh, fishing reports. We're following Mike on a, a tournament circuit. It's going to be awesome. So the content is still going to be flowing out on all of our social media. We're already planning for season four, where we're fishing, locations, who we're fishing with. Uh, it's going to be a blast, and we very much appreciate you guys coming along for the ride with us this whole season. Thank you again. Season 3 finale, Fish Addictions TV, the last vlog for Season 3 starts now. come on an event like this it's really uh, humbling especially for a guy from Texas who has grown up his whole life hearing about walleye fishing up here. It's therapeutic I mean it's being able to come out meet new people other vets have been through very similar situations that you have. This group of guys I mean I'm honored uh, just to be associated with them to know them uh, you already build those friendships. You know, I think that's something that's going to be long lasting after we leave here. And to be honest with you, there's a tournament supposed to be going on right now, but it's a blow day. <laughs> yeah, I was sitting here getting cold and kind of discouraged and then felt the tension. I was like, awesome. <laughs> Get him, Shane, get him. I'm trying, but we <laughs> can only hold so much. Got him. <laughs> it's crazy how close the veteran community is, and it actually was able to learn that two other veterans on this trip, we all were in the same exact unit, not at the same time, but it's crazy to find out yeah, everybody was just doing what we loved to do is fishing, so it was awesome. A lot of fish, I think, that's our 16th walleye this morning, so. A lot of throwbacks. 
So this is our fifth year in a row now that we've uh, partnered up with Fish Addictions. It's really actually one of our biggest and best events we do each year. This year we brought out eight awesome heroes. We flew in five from across the country. A lot of great stuff happening with these guys and all because you know we're able to, to fly out a couple more people than we normally do each year.